Well, the electronic security industry, it's, uh, it's not a new industry uh, anymore. Um, you know, access control companies you know, like TDSI have been around since uh, 1982. Uh, some of our competitors yeah, started yeah, in the early 80s, some of them in the, in the, in the late, uh, late 80s or, uh, or early 90s. We've gone from an analog world to uh, a digital world. And analog worlds were full of you know, closed protocols, very, very easy, very, very difficult to, uh, uh, to crack. With integrated systems and the advent of IP you know, over over a decade ago, so IP technology has enabled more and more integration, uh, which is a which is a good thing because it's uh, we're able to to, to to generate more data and use uh, data mining to actually look at uh, relationships um, between data sets that uh, hitherto we've not looked at relationships for. There are a lot of you know, legacy systems out there um, that are now being brought into you know, the, IP, the IP world. So um, when you know, systems are being uh, improved or installations are being improved, I think it's very, very important um, for the IP security uh, side of things to be really, really uh, uh, looked at uh, in detail. Um, and try to understand yeah, any inherent vulnerabilities from the legacy systems that might be installed uh, at a at a client's uh, site or sites, uh, and and uh, yeah, the need to the need to overcome that. That uh, knowledge might not necessarily be in the domain of yeah, the end user who's who's using that system. Um, it, it, it should be within the domain of, uh, of the installers uh, and, and, and maintainers, but technology is moving so quickly um, that uh, it, you know, the, the in installers might not be 100% you know, uh, up to speed with, uh, you know, with all the latest uh, stuff that's going on. I think there's a, you know, there's a big role that, you know, that uh, consultants uh, need, to, need to play uh, in evaluating legacy systems. Uh, and, and, and providing advice to end users and, and, and to maintainers on what needs to be done to uh, to, to, to actually bring them into uh, into a modern cyber secure world.